Hello, my beautiful Libras. Welcome to your weekly reading, weekly energies. First week in June, the week when we have a new moon in Gemini. Manifest big darlings. And also manifesting big in this milestone because we are in mid year. So here we are, darlings. A good time to look for the things you've done, those you want to do, and so on. Let's see, Libras, what do we have for you? What are the energies that we need to know for the week? And what else is there for you? Eight of Cups. Six of Cups. Knight of Swords. Five of Swords. Page of Wands. The Moon. Three of Pentacles. Plain and simple. Some of you, you might dealing here with someone that wants to come back. Either you left them before or they left you, but somebody here tries to come back. I don't feel here you 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 expect this or you want this person even back because I feel here needed a lot of healing and also there is no trust for some of you you still kind of upset they could have water in the chart they could have fire in the chart okay so before you answer or before you talk with this person, think about it. For, for some of you, it's just a, a very small message on a evening. Could be on a Friday evening or could be on a Saturday evening. Because I'm hearing Friday night, Friday evening. Saturday evening. Let's see. Seven of Cups. Knight of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. And the Magician. Okay, so you do have someone back or coming back, but also you have someone new. It's like you, you're manifesting something while waiting but i feel here whoever here is this person this new person things might not be set in stone or the connection is either in a friendship zone or you see each other but no strings or no not much into deep things so some of you Libras, you do have two people here. Let's see, what's the Seven of uh, Cups here for? Nine of Swords. Three of Swords. Six of Swords. Okay, so this new person is more likely came into your life like a catalyst. What I mean through that is you, you try to move on or try to, to fulfill your life with other things. Either to not think of your ex or try to heal being busy or try to get distracted and things like that. And that's how this person comes in. Sometimes, you know, the best people come in our life this way. Yes, you try to get through whatever you've been and that's why and whoever is this person is is giving you that energy of there are better people in life they are still good people who is this knight of cups who is this offer it's it's a godsend this is a godsend person or the universe send you this person so there is a, a universe sent person to you.
and this person wow this person is sent for you to bring healing and so you can overcome this karmic cycle you had with whoever you had you know every single person that cross our path it's sent for a reason this one sent to you it's for that reason was the seven of pentacles the sun ten of pentacles ten of swords and ace of pentacles it's kind of like you you can have a family with someone but I feel here with this ten of swords hurts because you wanted someone specifically to be with you it's like you you are happy that the universe sends you this person but for other reason you are not really happy having that new beginning or having not having a new beginning with whoever is that person but spirit says you ask for this person to come forward why did you ask in the first place let's see knight of wands they could be a sage but definitely it's a fire sign you ask for this person five of pentacles okay you ask for them because it was very hard to forget that person so you could finally move on from the other person because you are in a back and forth energy here what i'm feeling here whoever here is this person that the universe sends you looks very very strong as potential soulmate for some of you it's even your twin flame the only 10 missing is 10 of cups so the the one who is sent to you by the universe it's sent for you to be happy to find happiness the happiness that you deserve okay let's see here why this person is coming back what's the reason was the reason this person is back and after this time page of swords this person been watching your loves probably you've been watching them too but i feel here they they seen you probably with the other person or they seen you that you find a new love or that you make a choice yes so now i feel here this person could be watching you how how you grow how you've been growing and now they come with something it's it seems small whatever here they are gonna offer okay but you all might be surprised whatever they are gonna tell you also Either them or either you or either both could have um, another person. It seems here you do have another person, so that's why they come. Or something here didn't work out with someone they wanted to be. Okay. And there's another thing here. They like how much money you make or there's something here about you in the financial phase that you're doing well that's why they they come to okay yes you're probably doing great so it's not necessary that they come because they love you but because whatever you have to offer or whatever you do there let's see one advice here because i see you you made quite a progress over the time what advice we have from spirit honestly this person is something else but 
let's see what advice we have from spirit regards whatever you're going through right now you have a four of cups and the hangman you know in the first place why things didn't work and how much effort you put into healing into moving protect your heart because there is a lot of things you don't see coming in from this person just because they made a decision to come doesn't mean you gotta make a decision to accept them so think throughout or look deeper into the situation why they are here okay you wanted them here they are gonna be here but I feel here you'll realize how much you progressed and how little they progressed. Yes. If you want a particular closure with this person, so be it. Yes. Because that person could be even married or divorced or going through a divorce or separation. And my come, you know, the grass is greener on the other side. Be careful. Be careful to not fall for something very little. So Spirit says, before you make something major or before doing something which is not good, think. And think deep. You know how someone treats you. You know how someone, whatever someone does to, done to you. Don't forget. Because that's the human nature to forget. So Libras, that's what I got for you at this time. I hope this connects, resonates. If this speaks to you in any way, let us know. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.